Hi friends, now we are going to cover how to check the status of IDOCs. Okay, so in order to check status of IDOC, the transaction code is pretty easy, W02. And from here, you can find all the information you can think of. You can search, if you notice, you can search it based on time. You can search with based on the date. You can search it based on when it was last changed. The direction is very important because the direction tells you whether it's inbound or outbound, as we discussed. And then you have the current status. Every status is a number. And based on the number, you can pick which one is in error, which one is posted, and all those things. You can search based on basic type enhancement and all those things because the basic type tells you different transaction code that is related to. So you might there might be security issue where you want don't want to show every IDOX to everyone. So you might can you can put different uh, security process inside this uh, through variants using. WE02. So this is very useful. We'll discuss this in uh, details uh, in the system portion. 